What's up, everybody? Welcome to a Greg Way from Dave Fenoy's house. So, yes, everybody, as you know, Dave, well, first off, welcome to Greg Way. You're the first ever guest on a Greg Way. Well, you made me do it because you were at my house for dinner. Yeah, I'm at Dave Fenoy's house for dinner, so I kind of forced him to come down in his main And I, I love your shirt. That's what you call branding, huh? Shameless ah, self-promotion. I'll tell you what, yeah. game over, Greggy, DaveFanoy.com. Uh, Dave, if people for some reason didn't know you, I have no idea how they found this video then. Uh, you, you, of course, are the voiceover artist of our time. <laughs> you're the Hulu guy. You're Lee Everett in The Walking Dead. You're a big I, deal. I do what I can. Well, thank you for gracing our little show. Uh, well, basically what happens is every third, no, Wednesday, every Wednesday and Friday, mm -hmm. we answer a reader question or a viewer question or a video response, which they're phasing out. So now if you want to leave a video response, what you need to do is make your video and then just tweet me the link and I'll favorite it, but we'll get to that later. Uh, we answer a question, right? Okay. So today's question comes from Barack Attack. He says... Wait a minute. Is that like a... Funny name for the president. Yeah, it's the Bar it says it could be Barack, but it's it doesn't then it doesn't make any sense when you say the Barack attack. Well, it's got to be you, the Barack attack. If you're in attack. Syria, maybe you. Ooh, ah, ah. okay, topical humor with Dave Fenoy. Dad, uh, he heard, the other day I talked about my five favorite foods. I said these oh. are my five favorite foods. He says he wants me to list the five favorite foods again, but then talk about where to get each one of them. Where well, my what's what's your number one favorite? Number one, of course, is buffalo chicken wings. Ah, and so and so he like this is how the, it works. Number one's buffalo chicken wings. He wants to know where to go get buffalo chicken wings. Where do you go get them? Well, I mean, if I anywhere in the world, I'm gonna go to Columbia, Missouri. I'm gonna eat at CJ's, CJ's Hot Wings downtown. It's a, it's a Columbia, Missouri. It's a family joint. It's a, it's, a, it's a hallmark. You know what I mean? But in San Francisco, I'm gonna go to Wing Wings. Ah, Wing okay. Wings and Lower Hate Dynamite Food, another local joint, family run, owned and operated by two wonderful people. They know what's up. They make really good food there. You should go there. That's what I'm drawn to. You know, people always ask me, like, my opinion of a wing. I'm a big connoisseur of wings on the internet. Okay. You, okay. Uh, my, what are my, you know, what, what's my go-to of Buffalo Wild Wings? Or what do I think a wing stop? These uh, are fine. Do you like Buffalo Wild Wings? Yeah. And what yeah. is your go-to there? Oh, spicy garlic. Oh, okay. What about you? Uh, I like the spicy garlic, but I go for the habanero, mm. uh, the mm. little hotter thing. Sure, they sure, got sure, a Thai sure. one that is, mm. uh, uh, you know, when it's burning your mouth, yeah. it's just about It's right. doing its job right. Yes, I, I like these chain restaurants fine, but for me, I want to yeah. find that local joint. You know, the local uh, joint. The best, ones, uh, the best ones made, my girlfriend, Monique. Uh, she, has, she has wings called Mo Better Wings, and they are... But only a select few can get them. I was going to say, now I'm kind of mad that's not what you, you didn't make those for me tonight. But whatever. I guess I'll have to set up. Hey, look, I cooked Surf tonight. and turf. It was, it was awesome. I made steak and salmon. And a pie. And a pie. What more can he ask for? Dave, what's your favorite? What's your, what's your, you, you, no particular order if you want. You don't have to single anything out. What's, number, what's your first food you want to name on your five? My w number one favorite food, barbecued ribs. Ooh, ribs. And uh, the best ribs I've ever had in the world were my father's. My okay. father was a veterinarian. Well, you but keep naming places nobody can go. I, 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 <laughs> You're I know. Taking and the he's cop my, out. But <laughs> my, my dad is gone, but my mom lives on, yeah. and she makes those ribs now. Okay. Um, but, if I have to go get ribs now, and I do, I go to a place in Pasadena called Bonnie B's. Bonnie, Bonnie B's, B's on Lake Street. It's actually not in Pasadena. It's in Altadena. It's right up the road there. Okay, okay. Bonnie B's. Mm. Make you throw a rock at your mama. Mmm. I like those kind of ribs. Yeah. I like ribs a lot, too. That's the one thing in San Francisco we haven't found a great place to go to. Uh, right now what I do is I go Memphis Minis, also in Lower Haight. Lower Haight has good Greg Miller fat guy food. You uh, eat out a lot. No, well, now come on, you're you're casting a aspersion there. You don't really know. I, I don't mean it as a cast aspersion. I just you know so I, many restaurants. I'm a mine. I'm a man of uh, yeah, refined tastes. Ah, okay. I get around. I have to. Get <laughs> you to. don't cook. That's yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> I'm busy. I'm flying around the world, hanging out, eating here with you. I don't know what I'm doing. Everything on those lines. Uh, number two favorite food for me, pizza. I love pizza. Pizza? Yeah. Wings pizza. You're starting to wow. see how this all happened, Dave. Yeah. You're starting to see where this all came from. Pizza is its own food group. Yeah. Well, I didn't say food groups. I'm not going to be like, what? Like, you know what? Starches or whatever's in the pyramid. Little they don't even have a fact. food pyramid anymore. Little known fact. Well, well, it's a food circle with the pyramid. I never had a, pyra a pyramid. I never had a pizza until I went to college. Get the fuck out of here. How's that possible? Was it invented I, I yet? Was, it, <laughs> I know you're kind of old. Oh. <laughs> it's been lovely hanging out at Dave's house. <laughs> uh, but, hey, I just never had one. Weird. 
Um, is pizza well, not big in Texas? You're from Texas. Right? Well, no, no, my mom's from Texas. I grew up in Cleveland, Ohio, oh, and uh, Cleveland there's Little Hills. Italy, but you know, <laughs> we were all segregated then. You couldn't, oh, yeah. you couldn't go to Little Italy and get a pizza. No, I'm so sorry. I knew nothing about pizza well, until I went to college. Hmm. My favorite pizza place, of course, uh, if I'm in back in my home of Glen Ellen, Illinois, uh-huh. I'm going to Baroni's in downtown Glen Ellen. If I'm in Columbia, Missouri, I am going to Shakespeare's. Wow. And then if I'm in San Francisco, I'm going to Pa Cheese, which you, everyone knows because I talk about all the time. Or, and you know what? I um, I very rarely eat pizza now. Why? What's wrong with you? You you like you're you just found out about it. You should be eating it all the time. <laughs> well, I, I ate it for a long time. Uh, there were a couple of places in San Francisco I liked. Oh, actually, they weren't in San Francisco. They were in Berkeley. I can't remember the name of them, but they they were really good. Zachary's. A lot of people like Zachary's. That's I it. think Zachary's was one yeah. of the places. I know a lot about pizza. Yeah, I, I see. Yeah, I see. Now you see it. All right, what do you got for me? What's your next? Uh, you Thai food. And okay. I love okay. Thai food in all kind of places. Uh, Chandar in, in in L.A. is great, but there's another spot in North Hollywood. Uh, it's called uh, Barn Rao, and uh, it's actually halal. It's, it's it's like I go in the place, and the guy's Muslim, but he's Thai. And I didn't understand that at first, and all the food is halal, which is like the Muslim kosher. Okay. And, uh, but it's cool, and they've got uh, princes from... from uh, 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 Prince. So, not, no, not not the prince. Oh, damn. Uh, from Malaysia. The, the Malaysian royal family goes there to eat. Damn. But it's it's in a little strip mall in North Hollywood. You would never know. It looks like Ma and Pa See, running. See, that's what I'm talking about. Again, hole in the walls. Local joints. Yeah, this is what this is. It's, I mean, it's there's only one location. But the food is great. The service is great. Uh, and they're really cool. And uh, you will love it. You will. And if you like hot, you can get hot. You don't have to get hot. But if you like hot, you can get hot. All right, my number three favorite food, bagels. Again, carbs. Big carb guy. That's what makes me a big guy. Uh, what are you yeah. making face? What are you making? What do you, you got against bagels? Uh, you know, it's another food you didn't have for well, no, well, 35 <laughs> years. <laughs> Actually, to tell you the truth, I don't think I had a bagel until I was in college. It might have been after college that I had my first bagel. I might have been living in um, in the Bay Area. I might okay. have been living in Oakland or Berkeley or something. And you're like, what is this? This bread's gone bad. This donut doesn't look right. What's wrong with this stuff? What kind of donut is this? It ain't even sweet. <laughs> what are sprinkles? Well, that's onion. Bagels are delicious. Don't listen to it. Actually, I, I do like bagels. I wouldn't say that they are amongst my favorite sure, foods. Sure, they're not your third favorite food? No, they're not my third favorite Bread. <laughs> bread isn't your third favorite food like Greg Miller? No. Go to New York for an awesome bagel. Uh-huh. And if oh, you're, yeah. If you're in San Francisco... This is, a, this is a trick. This is a pro tip from Greg Millen. And this is just around the IGN office, obviously, because I don't get around to eat a lot of bagels. But you want to get a New York-style bagel, a boiled bagel. We've talked mm-hmm. about it. I'll link it here so we don't block Dave. This is but a, see, I, no matter where you are, you cannot get a bagel as good as a New York bagel. And right. Do you know why? The water. The water. They boil them the in water. Special, the water, and it's, 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 it's that all that New about. York water comes right out of the sewer of the air. But if you're in San Francisco, there's the Great American Bagelry, I call it. I think its real name is the Bagel Bakery. It doesn't matter. Uh, but the real trick is to go to Ironside in the morning because uh-huh. they buy the Great American Bagelry bagels, bring them to their own restaurant, but then when you ask them toasted, they toss them in their oven. And it's a better t- than the toaster oven that does like the weird the, 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 the conveyor belt. This is a real oven. Pro tip. Then you rip and you dip in the cream cheese. Yeah. Give me your next one, Dave. Oh, what a, oh, yeah, a fried catfish. Fried catfish. I love fried catfish. And uh, the best place in the world for fried catfish is a little spot that, once again, is no longer there anymore. Uh, it, as long as you don't come out with, like, your aunt's house was, or something. No, that. it's not my aunt's house. It was a restaurant called uh, uh, Bayou Landing in Uncertain, Texas. The name of this town is Uncertain, Texas. And they called it that because when they town put itself together they filled out the paperwork to send to the state and they weren't sure what they wanted to call it so where it said name of town since they hadn't made up their minds they wrote in uncertain that's and that, awesome that became the name of the town uncertain texas bayou landing but the place burned down <laughs> that's sad yeah and my uncle bill who's no longer with us was he inside uh he's gone he's gone but uh, yeah, was, he's, was, he's he, gone he, on to the upper room. But, uh, but he wasn't inside when it burned down. No, no, <laughs> no, no, no. But he used to make great catfish. But now there's a spot in uh, right on the Pasadena uh, Altadena line called Louisiana Catfish on okay. Washington. 
and uh, tell him Dave sent you. And he'll say, Dave who? Or say, oh, the Dave guy with, the guy with the, the gray dreadlocks. Oh, the guy with that nice voice? Yeah. Okay, I got you. Okay. Uh, my fourth favorite food, broccoli. I like broccoli, too. Thank you so much. You know who doesn't like broccoli? Who's that? Matt, let's show the video. Hey, Greg, this is Matt from Ohio. This is Funyuns. Listen, I'm a big fan, but I got to call you out on one thing. How are you such an advocate and a high-ranking team member of Team Fat, and one of your favorite foods is broccoli? Broccoli, really. I mean, come on. What's that about? Matt, 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 you got you to gotta eat your broccoli, man. Fuck broccoli, you, Matt. Broccoli is good for you. Broccoli will fight cancer off for you. Eat your broccoli, Matt. Damn right. That's the thing. You see, I don't, I don't, I don't like this misrepresentation of him, him calling. I, I, I lead Team Fat publicly, <laughs> happily. I talk about being fat. That I'm, I like this. But I'm you're gonna, not, you're not really fat. I don't, I don't be one of these haters. I, uh, this I'm is, not, 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 I'm this not, is not this got, is, Look at that. Look at that. Like I got the wrong kind of hourglass figure. There's some figure, gelatinous uh, globule stuff going on yeah, there, yeah. but I've seen much, much worse. Well, sure, but I'm leading Team this, Fat. On this the is internet. America. As fat goes, this really is. Okay. Well, part of being Team Fat is being able to eat whatever you want whenever you want it. And so if I want to eat broccoli, I'm going to eat some goddamn broccoli. Nothing's okay. going to stop me. I love well, broccoli. I'm it's delicious. You, I like it raw, right off the stalk. Well, broccoli isn't helping you with the fat. As a matter of fact, uh, you could be much fatter if you would leave the broccoli out. But see, again, this more. is my whole thing with Team Fat. Now we're getting into the hashtag Team Fat debate. I'm not saying that I'm looking to gain weight or get moving. And I'm, I'm just fat, and I'm going to do it. I'm going to eat wings all the time. I'm going to do what I want. I'm, I want some broccoli. Okay. That's what I'm going to eat it. I don't care. I'm not, I'm not, if you're telling me broccoli is too good for me, I'm not doing anything because it's bad for me. <laughs> I enjoy salad. I like eating salad. Not I've never heard like of that. a food that might be too good for you. Mm -hmm. Well, see, that's why they're going to start calling my team fat into question. Greg Miller's going to get fired up. <laughs> well, you know, I got the gym over there. You no, we're going to see that. We're definitely we not doing it. We can pump some iron, get you in shape. All right, it's about time for me to leave. <laughs> What's your next favorite food? Oh, boy. Well, I had made those. Oh, oh. Guilty pleasure. I, I have to confess. Ginger Roos from Trader Joe's. I don't know what this is. They are an amazing cookie. They're so good. They're, they're chewy. They've got a little piece of ginger in there. And you pour your glass of milk. And you get your ginger roux. And you take a bite. And you wash it down with some milk. You in heaven. My How about you? Fifth and final favorite food, sushi. Oh, I love sushi. I love sushi. It's so I, 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 what, what, now, what sushi is your favorite? Oh, I enjoy uh, taco, the octopus. Uh, oh. if I, if I, I like the octopus. I'm a little you know, that there. just, you know, going down your throat, the little tentacles and yeah, stuff. Yeah, clinging to the inside. No, I, um, no, what's your favorite sushi? Maguro. I like the, uh, I, I like the, uh, the, the, the tuna and yeah. the salmon, uh, the yellowtail. Um, those are... Pretty much my favorites. I'll do the shrimp. There's some other. I'll do some mackerel and whatnot. But my actual favorite, yeah, the tuna and the okay. salmon. You like the fatty tuna or the what? Just the regular old tuna? Either either way. Yeah, either okay. Way. That's a good choice. If and you're going get lots for... of wasabi in there to, you know, you to get... Oh, oh sure, yeah. That kick, oh. you that kick. But that, that's what... Uh, Damon always talks about this. Yeah. Uh, my friend... Uh, my lots of ginger. My hetero life mate. Uh, Damon doesn't <laughs> like hot foods that much, but he yeah. likes wasabi because it's a kick and it's over. Yeah, you're not you're not stuck with the rest. You can't and it's not taste you. your food. And it's is good it for you? I don't yeah. know that. Well, so I'm sure now I'm gonna get yelled at for using it. Hey, hey you know, haters just... of Team Fat. If you're in San Francisco and you're looking for good sushi, here's my recommendation: Katana Ya off of Powell down there, off of Powell Bar, Powell Muni. People people go to Katana Ya all the time because it's a little hole in the wall. It's in all the magazines for the best ramen in the city, but they also have fantastic sushi, and that's what I like to get there. Hmm. Um, I don't really have a favorite place for sushi anymore. Uh, there's a few places that I like. Um, Japan. Uh, you know what? I've been through Japan, never spent any time in Japan. You need to correct that. Beautiful oh, yeah. country. I was on my way to Thailand, and I uh, had to stop and, you know, gas up. Sure, sure. <laughs> <laughs> um, but salmon salad at Aroma Cafe. This is your sushi, or this is your, your final food? This is my final food. Salmon salad. A salmon salad. What uh, all goes into that? Uh, obviously salmon. Well, obviously salmon, and you've got sam uh, salad. And uh, it would be with, you know, uh, spring greens and some spinach and some carrots and, and tomato and uh, a nice balsamic vinaigrette dressing and, you know, the salmon grill just perfectly. And mm. 
nice iced tea to go with that. And man, it's just a little piece of heaven at the Aroma Cafe. And you never know who you're going to run to. A lot of celebrities go in the Aroma like Cafe. Like Dave Fenoy. Uh, yeah, yeah. Who else? Who, who you seen there? Um, Ashley Johnson, you ever see her? Ashley Johnson? Yeah, exactly. No, Who's I, that? I, I haven't run into Ashley Johnson. Uh, I did run into Jill Scott, the singer and actress, uh, the other day, and I, I asked her if I could take her picture because, of course, I was going to Instagram it, and she said no. She was very nice about it. Okay, so but she's she not said, dead to us? Oh, no, she's not okay, dead right. to us. She's she's wonderful. She had just come from working out or something. She said, oh, I look terrible, oh, please. Uh. And, you know, she's a girl, so I, okay. I said, you know, I respect that. I respect that. But I love you. I love your music. And uh, she smiled and uh, blew a kiss and, and left. Oh, well, good. I'm glad that had a happy ending. Yeah. Just like this Greg Way did. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, every Wednesday and Friday, I got it that time, uh, we post one of these where we answer one of your questions. So leave your question as a comment below or make your own YouTube video, then tweet at Game Over Greggy. Look at that. I don't even have to put up graphics anymore. Yeah. And uh, you, maybe you're featured on the were show. Were you pointing at your tits? Well, no, just the. Well, oh, okay, the Game Over Gary guy. Just, <laughs> I just wanted to make sure. Mm -hmm. Dave, thanks so much for joining me. Everybody go to DaveFenoy.com. Follow Dave on Twitter at DaveFenoy as well. Well, man, you're, you're I'm really around. upset he didn't tell you that his favorite place to eat was my house because I did steak and grilled it wasn't, salmon. It wasn't what's your favorite broccoli. restaurant, Dave. He loves broccoli. I did broccoli. It was really good, too. Everything was great tonight. You didn't ask what my favorite restaurant was. Well, that's my favorite true. restaurant, okay. Dave Fenoy's house. You can find it right here. <laughs> Read off <laughs> oh, the wait. <laughs> They'll all be coming over. Stop! We'll see you next time on the next Greg Way. What is up, Bo? Hey, come Bo. On, come on, Bo. Come on, let's make you a star. There's no Fertillo in this video, I forgot. That's Bo. That's Bo. Get my doggy Bo. That's Bo. That'll have to substitute for Fertillo. Oh. Oh.